Local cemeteries and crematoriums have been overwhelmed as the COVID-19 deaths cross the 1 million mark globally. Italian parish priest Don Mario opened his church doors to hundreds of coffins during the difficult time in the Lombardy region, one of the worst hit regions in Italy. This report tells you more. Not many have felt the weight of Italy's coronavirus death toll the way that the Italian parish priest Don Mario Carminati has. Don Mario opened the doors of his church to coffins in the wake of the pandemic as many cemeteries and crematoriums had reached full capacity. At a time when people of faith have refrained from visiting the church, Don Mario's church has housed hundreds of coffins. Families reached out to Don Mario in the northern Italian town of Seriate for their dear departed ones. We had organized the place to host 80 coffins and one day we received 76 coffins at the same time. That had a heartbreaking impact on me, something that left me with a great bitterness. Then the fear. That memory is also essentially linked to a situation of silence marked by the soundtrack of the ambulances. This is the thing. And they would never stop. They would drive by continuously and one would wonder, when will this end? This is the thing that made winter more tragic then. There were no leaves on the trees and it was all grey. I don't even remember what the weather was really like then, but I certainly remember it as something grey and dark, something from which you felt like you couldn't get out, a tunnel that never ended. Initially, Don Mario had hoped that a place to be able to accommodate about 80 coffins would be enough. This, however, was far from sufficient. In just about two months, the town had lost around 200 people as opposed to the 180 on an average in a year. Another grim fact was that many of these numbers did not figure in Italy's official COVID-19 toll. This as many lost their lives at home or at nursing homes without even being able to get tested. One million victims. It is really a war. These are really numbers of a war. This is a terrible thing. Maybe we should multiply the numbers. We don't even know the real numbers. I think we are well beyond this figure we are now talking about. This is something that must make us think. Otherwise, we are not human beings. Italy was one of the first Western countries to have been hit by the virus, which was followed by a strict lockdown. By the end of March, Bergamo had registered a 571% increase in deaths compared to the five-year monthly average. This was one of the biggest localised increases in excess mortality in Europe. Lombardy region continues to be the worst hit. Despite having felt the weight of Italy's toll so closely, Don Mario thanks the healthcare workers and the doctors for their sacrifices. Bureau report, We on World is One.